Well, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Charlie Sylvia with Cruise Lines International Association. Um, we have a very, very special call for you today. Uh, thank you for being here, by the way. Um, and uh, we are delighted, absolutely delighted to have Uniworld and you by Uniworld with us today. And a dear friend of mine, who is one of the leaders in the cruise industry. In fact, he not only he not only is the senior vice president of global sales for the Uniworld Boutique River Cruise Collection and you by Uniworld, but he is also the chairman of the CLIA Trade Relations Committee, which means that he represents the cruise lines to CLIA in terms of how they benefit our CLIA travel agency members and individual agent members. What this all means, ladies and gentlemen, is that our presenter today is a huge proponent of the trade. He is a champion for the trade and he works diligently to support travel agencies and agents. Christian Anderson, as I mentioned, Senior Vice President of Global Sales for the Uniworld Boutique River Cruise Collection and you by Uniworld, he is, he is responsible for the commercial management and strategic distribution of sales and trade support. Now, prior to Uniworld, Christian was the Senior Vice President General Manager of the Americas for Silver Sea Cruises Limited and the Vice President of Sales for the Americas for Qatar Airways. Now, he's a seventh generation Louisianan. Uh, I hope I said that right, Christian. And he has worked within the travel industry since the age of 18, so for about 20 years. <laughs> I'm kidding. And then he, he received his, B, uh, his Bachelor of Science in Communications at the University of Houston and lives in Los Angeles, where he's lived for, since the past, uh, for the past two years. Christian Anderson, my friend, it's a pleasure to have you here. Charles. You know, gosh, I just listened to you talk, and I, uh, probably everyone on this call right now is just mesmerized with your voice, and you say such <laughs> incredibly kind and nice things. You could go on for hours, and I think I just, I just uh, would tune in. And, uh, you really should look into a, a sideline as a radio, uh, a radio host, which yeah. I think you might have already done once. I right? have, I have done the that, year. Christian. Right. Oh, and, and no, you know what? You know what I forgot to say, Christian, I, and I apologize. I forgot to tell the folks that, hey, um, we're going to go about 30, 35 minutes, Christian's presentation, and um, and then we're going to have about 10 minutes of questions and answers. So we'll try to answer every single question that comes in, if possible. Um, so please use the questions field in the GoToWebinar panel uh, at any time uh, to submit your questions, and we'll get to all of them. Um, and also, if you please, um, I, I know that many of you subscribe to our YouTube channel, CLIA Global, C-L-I-A Global. Um, this webinar will be recorded and housed, stored on CLIA Global, posted on CLIA Global on the YouTube channel. Um, but we want you to be here with us so that you can ask questions. And actually, we're going to randomly submit at the end of the call. Uh, two winners will win a CLIA branded pop socket, which is the coolest gadget ever for your smartphone. It, it helps you hold it easier and make sure you don't drop it and you can type easier. So without further ado, Christian Anderson, welcome to today's webinar, sir. Thanks, Charles. I really appreciate it. And again, thank you for such a, a kind introduction. And uh, you're you're right about something uh, that you, you mentioned. Uh, I am certainly a trade advocate, a trade proponent. Uh, champion, that's a very kind word to use, but I really do champion uh, the partnerships that exist between suppliers and our trade partners uh, and the value that a travel agent, a travel advisor is able to bring uh, to the uh, vacation and ho uh, holiday cruise, ex uh, cruise experience for a consumer. You know, there's a there's an expression that's often used in our industry that without a travel agent, you're on your own. And there is probably nothing more accurate than that. You know, a travel uh, advisor, a travel agent is uh, the consumer's advocate, uh, you know, looking after their best interest. And, you know, the partners that we work with, uh, on average, not always, there's or just as in life, there's always exceptions, but the partners that we work with have been typically in the industry for a number of years and have a, a very significant book of business. And you can sit down with each one of them, as I often do, and they can relay stories to you where, uh, you know, a consumer uh, decided, a client, a customer decided to not use a travel agent and found themselves stuck somewhere 
delayed on a flight, uh, missing a cruise, you name it, and they had no one to turn to and no one to support them and no one to, to assist. And that's just one of the multiple benefits that our travel partners bring into the equation. And the thing that I personally find so uh, rewarding about working with our partners is, is their validation. You know, and uh, when someone is able to go on board or experience Uniworld for themselves, as so many of our travel partners have, they come back with a renewed sense of conviction and belief in that experience, and they're able to communicate that to their guests with certainty. And, you know, after you've worked with someone for uh, a number of years or, or you've purchased uh, a number of holiday experiences through that individual, you really do take their word for granted and you have confidence in what they're saying because they walk the walk and they talk the talk. And, and in, in our world today, that's a really uh, unique commodity. It's very hard to find. Online is cold. The internet can be a very cold place. But on the other end of that phone or there in person, uh, the validation and honesty and hard work ethic of our travel partners keep this industry alive and vibrant. And I'm very, very proud to, to be a part of that. But today, what I really want to share, and in the interest of time, and as I noted earlier, and I think you, you mentioned it, I am a seventh generation Louisianian. So if my accent or my voice if it's a little slower than what you might be used to, I'm going to try to push through this, this presentation today, and, and I certainly welcome and encourage any questions uh, at the conclusion. But, um, you know, there we'll start with what you're seeing is, and today what we're really going to be talking about is sort of where Uniworld is headed uh, in the future and where things are today and, and what we're looking at doing uh, in, the, in the next two, three, four years. Uh, you know, the, the river industry is extremely dynamic. It's, there are multiple players, multiple options in the market today, and, and that's great. The, the consumer deserves that. The consumer deserves to have an opportunity to identify which brand or which company might be best for them. And, of course, selfishly speaking, we feel that we were something for everyone, and we certainly offer that. But I wanted to show today and, and share with everybody where we're going and what that and what that means in real terms. Uh, so, you know, we believe in living your, your best life. And, and what I mean by that is, you know, everything we do at Uniworld is focused on one singular goal, and that is to give the guests a truly unique and unforgettable experience. Uh, and the hallmark of doing that is by the personalized sort of service that is really industry leading. It's it's an example that we set for the entire industry uh, that we believe the guest deserves. We believe our travel partners deserve the best support. Uh, they deserve a response. They, der they deserve reliability. And our guest, your customers, our guest, your clients, our guests deserve the very best in service, in cuisine, in decor, and of course, in the immersive experience that we offer. I'm trying to, uh, there we go. So right there, what, you, what you're seeing are the grand staircases of our three most recent ships. And I, and I would encourage you to take a look at the detail. This is a, these are real photos on, on, uh, and on to your left there, what you're seeing is the grand staircase and, and entrance of the Joie de Vivre, which we launched uh, last year, and she's in Paris, that's her home. Next to that is the Maria Theresa, which does the Danube, and is just, you know, named after the Empress Maria Theresa, and it's, it's Baroque beauty and, and heavy influence, and that is so reflective of the actual destination. And then, of course, at the very right, you'll see the Grand Staircase, brand new. We just reintroduced her into the market about two months ago. Uh, she was a what we refer to as the River Beatrice, and now she is a super ship Beatrice. And, of course, you'll see the, the beautiful staircase and the chandelier and the fresh flowers, which is another hallmark of, of uh, Uniworld. But I refer to it as a super ship, and that's one distinction that really is important to make. We are moving to an all super ship fleet. And you might ask, well, what exactly does that mean? And that's, and that's a very good question. It, it means that more dining options. It means more suites available. It means a, gr a grand staircase and open air lobby 
uh, on each ship. You know, one thing that uh, is a characterization of a lot of river ships across the industry, that regardless of company, is that, you know, because of, of uh, bridges and walkways and what have you, the ships can sometimes seem a little compressed. And we believe in opening up the public spaces as much as possible, the highest ceilings possible, uh, so that when a guest walks in, they feel that, uh, that, that sense of invitation and that sense of warmth. And in our case, something we're very proud of, just this absolutely uh, incredibly beautiful sense of welcome. You know, we want people to feel welcome. So each of our, uh, our luxury hotels are, are, I beg your pardon, I always say that, but because it, it's a very easy mistake to make. Each one of our ships are luxury floating boutique hotels, and no one ship is alike, and in often cases, no one stateroom looks like the other stateroom. So it's, and it speaks to uh, the heritage of the, of the beauty and the colors, all reflect the heritage of the destination that we're in. You are truly in Europe. Europe doesn't stop when you're on board Uniworld. And, uh, it, you know, if you're, if you're on the ship and you get off into a great little town and walk around and you have this great sense of Europe that you're really enjoying and then you get back on the ship and that seems to stop, that is not the case with Uniworld. And regardless of the part of the, the world we might be in, whether it's Asia or Egypt, we're on the Nile or in the Mekong and, and, and Vietnam, we, we characterize our ships to reflect that destination so, you're in, so your entire holiday experience carries over, whether you're on board or ashore. Christian, can I yeah. can I just jump in and 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 say that uh, uh, let everyone know that you know I just came back from a seven night experience on the SS Joie de Vivre, um, and I have to tell you, Christian, what you just said was so accurate. We stayed in one of the finest hotels in Paris before we departed, uh, the Georges Cinq, and you know what, I felt when we stepped onto the Joie de Vivre, we were at the same, I mean, it was just that same like six star luxury level. And what what really struck me was just the comfort and the, I, it was not only strikingly beautiful and luxurious, but I felt so comfortable. And I just had to say that because uh, this was one of the, the, the finest cruises that I've ever been on. And ladies and gentlemen, uh, you're on the right call. Let's let's put it that way. And I, forgive me for interrupting, Christian. Oh, Charles, I really appreciate that. It's it's like I said earlier. You know, validation is everything. And you've been on. I know you probably have uh, an, an exact idea of how many cruises you've been on. I know just knowing you personally, <laughs> you've been on you know dozens and dozens and dozens and dozens of cruises. So you are truly a cruise connoisseur, and you know it when you see it. And not only that, it just the personal validation is really encouraging. So thank you for, for offering that up. It means a great deal to us. And I'm, as I mentioned, I'm so glad that you and your spouse had a phenomenal time. It was just it's, it's as we would want it. Um, so one of the characterizations, getting back to uh, what we're sharing today about Uniworld, is that we truly are all-inclusive. And we offer all of our, all of our all-inclusive amenities are part of one price. And you know, the fact is, is, you know, what's included, a lot of people sometimes want to, to make sure that they understand that. And of course, it's our impeccable service with, we have one of the highest staff to guest ratios of any cruise line, whether ocean or river, uh, beautifully, uniquely decorated, one of a kind ships. All of our gratuities, both aboard, on board and ashore are included. And that's a, that's a very important distinction to make. Sometimes, Someone, uh, other lines might say, well, we're all inclusive. You don't pay any gratuities. But then when you're doing a shore excursion, that's not necessarily part of that program. And guests sometimes have to reach into their pocket to express their gratitude uh, toward a, uh, a tour operator. In our case, all those gratuities are included. Uh, again, one price that you pay, one price that the guest pays, and it's all included. Uh, airport transfers to and from uh with uh, to the ship when you book air through Uniworld so the transfers are included uh Riverview staterooms and suites with marble bathrooms and handcrafted uh Savoir beds Savoir of England uh, perhaps the best uh night sleep you'll ever experience 
Uh, in suite butler service, 24 hour room service and concierge service. Very important to note about butler service. Uh, again, uh, it's, a, it's, it's something that a lot of different companies do, but what you'll find oftentimes is that that butler is not necessarily a true butler. Uh, they're cross utilized. Uh, you might see them in the dining room serving wine one evening. You might see them, uh, I've even been on ships where they were cleaning. Um, uh, the fact of the matter is we have a hierarchy in our system and the butler sits on the top of that mountain. He's at the top of the food chain, so to speak. And our butlers are trained at the same institution in the United Kingdom that trains uh, the butlers for the royal household which I'm quite certain are going to be very busy this upcoming weekend. Uh, but that is something that's important to note and make a distinction of because the attention to detail, the attention to the care and the concern of each and every guest and their unique preferences is nurtured by uh, our incredible staff and our butlers in particular. Uh, and of course, that's included uh, in suite. Gourmet dining with unlimited beverages, including premium spirits, beer, and regional wines. There's no cap. There's no wave off. There's no final call. It's all included. Uh, enticing excursions that are led by English speaking, English fluent speaking, I should mention, local experts, so that there's an understanding and a clear communication of where you are and, and what the guest might be experiencing. And, and they can leave from that saying, wow, that was truly remarkable. I understood. I knew where I was. I knew what the experience was about. Um, authentic cultural experiences that are exclusive to Uniworld. And we'll kind of go over that in, in a few moments. Onboard Fitness Center for those that might want to burn off a few calories from, from one of the incredible meals or a uh, bottle of wines. Uh, uh, bicycles, helmets, Nordic walking poles for uh, onshore use, uh, shipwide Wi-Fi, onboard local entertainment, signature lectures, and everything is custom customizable aboard the cruise, including the inclusions. So that's really, when we say all inclusive, the emphasis is not necessarily on the inclusive part of that term. The emphasis is on the all, A-L-L. -L. It truly is all inclusive. Moving right along here, did you know? This is something that we are starting to introduce uh, throughout our sales narrative and throughout our presentations. So many people are not aware of some of the small little things that we often say. Uh, you know, it's one thing to say we're all inclusive and that includes all premium spirits and liquors. It's another thing to say, did you know that we serve 28 different whiskeys on board? 19 of which are completely complimentary. So your top, top, top shelf may not necessarily be included, but they're available and, and they're rare. And that is uh, something that's quite a treat. How can we make your day remarkable? And the fact is we have a few ideas because no request is too large and no detail is too small. If a guest simply asks for it, if they simply request it, we're going to do our absolute best to try to ensure that that request can be fulfilled, that need can be met. Uh, we'll entertain any option because truly it's, it's not too big, it's not too small. We're gonna to try to make it work if we can. And that's a hallmark of our, lux of our commitment to what we consider luxury to be. Um, you know, this is a shot of, and speaking of the joie de vivre, this is the average uh, restroom, bathroom facility in on board the Schwa de Vivre in a stateroom. And what you'll notice there is, again, the tiny noticeable touches that are not immediately obvious to the naked eye. You might not see it. But aside from the beautiful wood yacht-like finish of the wood paneling and the Oryx marble, what you might not realize is that the floor right below is heated that the towel rack behind the mirror is heated, that there is a, uh, on the mirror itself, if you come out of a hot, steamy shower, there is a portion of that mirror that does not steam over, it does not fog over. These are the tiny, noticeable touches that of course we don't charge extra for, it's all included, but if you're, if you're selling at the first or latter part of the selling season in Europe, it can still be a little cool and chilly in the mornings or in the evenings. And if you're showering and you step out, you don't want to, to, to be cold. You want to be, you want to stay warm. And 
that heated floor, that heated towel rack, the fact that you can uh, prepare yourself and, and, and do what is, might be necessary right after the shower with a, a, a clear mirror is, it's just small little tiny noticeable touches that sometimes are not necessarily noticed, but people always remark when they come off the experience, wow, you know, I hadn't thought of it, but that was a really nice addition to the experience. And uh, I'll use Charlie's favorite uh, phrase, ladies and gentlemen, that's just the bathroom. That's just <laughs> the bathroom. So uh, another did you know, did you know that the majority of our crew returns season to, to the tune of about 94, 95 percent? Our crew is treated like family. We are, they are considered employees. They are not contractual. And they come back season after season. And we absolutely put a great deal of emphasis on their training, on their responsiveness, and the, and the characterization about our staff and, and the, the, our concept of service is that it's anticipatory. We believe in keeping an eye open. We believe in learning. We believe in, in speaking to the guest and getting to know that guest and where they're from and what they may enjoy. And what um, if a guest is walking uh, a little slower or if a guest is uh, a little more active, we start to craft and create uh, our service amenities and our service uh, order around those uh, particular details of the guest we anticipate meaning if you're sitting down on the first evening and the bartender asks you uh, what can I serve you and you say a bourbon with two ice cubes I can assure you that there is a 99.9% .9 chance that for the remainder of your voyage on those seven days or longer you're going to be uh, that bartender will see that guest and say here's your bourbon with your two ice cubes it's anticipatory service at its very finest Farm to table. This is really important because what farm to table is, it's, an, it's, a, it's a term that's being used in the industry today, uh, it, it, especially in the European market. Uh, and a lot of folks have it, but farm to table is fresh. That's what it's about. And it's something that we put a huge emphasis on. So uh, we use and source food that is grown locally throughout the European markets that we serve. So not only are you enjoying cuisine, that is reflective of that destination, you know, the best pasta while you're in Venice, uh, et cetera. Uh, you, you will find that though that cuisine, that food is actually sourced in those markets. So if you're, if you decide to stay for whatever reason, and I don't encourage it, but if you happen to be, or your guest happens to be on board one day and decides, you know, I'm not going to do the excursion. I'm just going to uh, stay here and enjoy the sun and read a book or what have you. They might look down uh, from their, their, their suite or from the top deck, and they may see uh, local uh, trucks and companies coming in, little mom and pop shops uh, with the wooden fence uh, on the back of the truck, unloading fresh vegetables, fresh uh, food, uh, and that will be used that evening for dinner. It is farm to table, and it's something we're incredibly proud about. And you know, Mrs. Tolman, our, our, the co-founder of Red Carnation Hotels, our sister brand, uh, which we are, Uniworld is a, a proud member of the, the Travel Corporation's family of, of brands. If you've heard of Contiki, if you've heard of Insight, if you've heard of Red Carnation, uh, those are our sister brands. And Mrs. Tolman uh, has built a career and a life, truly a life, a legacy rather, of her over 60 plus years of experience in hospitality. And, you know, she is the inspiration behind, the creative inspiration behind our cuisine and how we serve food and the type of food that we serve. And many of the dishes are, are directly uh, uh, designed on the recipes that she has authored. And one of the, the thing that I love about Mrs. Tolman, which are, there are many things actually, uh, but one of the things that she often says that I, I hold dear to my heart because it reminds me of my own uh, background and, and family is that she says food should be delicious. Don't overdo it. Don't try to make it over over the top in its appearance where it's a, it's a fig leaf with a, a gelatin creation that looks like some sort of uh, carnival-like uh, uh, modern art piece. Food should be delicious. It should be enjoyable. It should be comforting in many ways. And we take great pride in that, knowing that one of the things that we want you to be able to say is, wow, that was one of the best meals I've ever had anywhere at any time. 
And that's something that we take, uh, again, uh, a great uh, care to ensure is delivered each and every time. And we serve over, by the way, 32 different kinds of cheeses on uh, across all of our ships. And we're a member of the Joint Dutch Receive Board uh, there in France uh, because we do source fresh ingredients from the destinations that you visit, meaning a great example, and, and, and Charlie just lived through this just a couple of weeks back, but you're dining on authentic French cuisine in the very heart of France. And, and honestly, isn't that what it's about? I don't think you want to be in the heart of France eating lobster from Maine. I think you want to be in the heart of France enjoying the incredibly beautiful, uh, incredibly delicious, uh, local sourced, farm to table French cuisine uh, that is known and celebrated throughout the world. Uh, this is one of our favorite parts of this presentation. It's about our, our exclusive experience, which we have over 80 of them. They're once in a lifetime opportunities for each and every uh, Uniworld guest. And whether it's Prague, Prague uh, going to a private concert in Prague at the Estates Theater or to a tour of one of the largest collection, if not the largest collection of Van Gogh works in Amsterdam, uh, you know, it's truly when a moment becomes a masterpiece. And if there was any one expression that I could say, you know, try to remember that in this presentation, that's about it because that's what travel is all about. That's what a vacation should be all about. And when it comes to river cruising and especially on Uniworld, we try to craft these moments along the way each and every day that become a masterpiece that you will come home, the guests will come home and be so proud to share with their family members and their friends and their colleagues at work or what have you and say, you know, that was really, I had never seen anything like that. I've never witnessed anything like that. And Uniworld made that happen for us. And most importantly, my travel partner, my travel agency made Uniworld happen for me. So these exclusive experiences, again, it's, they're meticulously planned and expertly guided, uh, and over 80 of which are, in, you know, basically ours. And whether it's the vinegar estate tasting uh, in Germany or the after hours visit in the evening at St. Mark's Basilica in Venice or an artisanal aware, a wine pairing in the heart of the, uh, the wine region in the south of France, over an 85 acre state. It, these destinations are one of a kind and no one else uh, does this like we do. And that's the key thing to mention. You know, they might go to some of the same places. They might have a similar type of tour, but no one is going to be able to provide the kind of access and behind the scenes and one of a kind exceptional uh, attributes of that tour as we do uh, to, and, and I keep saying it but I but I just want to make sure that it's over 80 of them so there's so many different options and there's something for everyone and I don't take my word for it you don't take Charlie's word for it uh, you know whether it's cruise kit critic whether it's uh, travel and leisure whether it's the travel awards in, in the UK uh, we are probably the line in the industry today uh, where we take it very, very serious. Uh, you know, we don't rest our accolades on these awards because the greatest, uh, the greatest award that we can have is our our guest satisfaction rating and the the value of our travel partners and how they uh, understand us to be able to work and support what they do each and every day. But we're very proud of these awards nonetheless, and and we're very hopeful and optimistic that this will continue uh, as we move along. So the world at a glance, I mentioned it earlier, where all do we go? Um, uh, well, Europe, you know, we are in the heart of Europe. We're everywhere in Europe. We're in France, we're in Portugal, we're in the Netherlands, Germany, Italy. Uh, we go into Austria, Slovakia, Croatia. Uh, and But we also are in India, you know, on the Ganges River. We are in uh, China. We're in Southeast Vietnam, uh, South, Southeast Asia, rather, in Vietnam, Cambodia. And, uh, you know, we're also in Russia. So uh, we, we go to places that people have demonstrated a desire that they want to see uh, from the vantage point and from the experience that only a true river cruise experience can offer. And our destiny, you know, Egypt, for example, I know this is a, uh, it's been a, a topic in the news for years now, the last several years, and things have truly stabilized in that, in, uh, in that environment and in, in the country. And we have seen 
a remarkable uh, uptick in bookings in Egypt over the last year. We refer to these other markets outside of Europe as our exotics, and Egypt is our definitely, without question, our most popular exotic at the moment, uh, and it's selling, to use a phrase, like hotcakes. Um, don't settle for anything less than the best. That would be the number one thing I could tell you. Just don't settle. Uh, you know, our FIFO rating, we use a company called FIFO. We, they are a uh, outside vendor. Uh, we have no influence in their editorial contributions. We cannot uh, edit. We cannot change what is provided to us. This is, un this is guest feedback, unsolicited. Uh, the guest chooses to respond. Uh, and provides that feedback, and we post, post this uh, rating uh, on our website. Uh, it's there right now, and we average 4.9 out of 5 for a FIFO rating. So if you think of something like a Yelp or something along those lines, this is uh, one that we use. It, it, it services the hospitality industry, and we continue to rank uh, the highest in the industry today. Our, our guest to staff ratio is 2.7 to 1, so that's almost three people to one in sparse service. Uh, we have a 17 ship fleet that is 100% company in, uh, owned and uh, privately owned, and our staff and crew is 100% company employee. employee. Uh, we've been in the industry for over 40 years, since 1976, and our, on average, our ships accommodate about 130 guests. 24-hour room service, fitness center, onboard spa, indoor heated swimming pool, so it's always available, uh, even in inclement weather, onboard wellness instructor uh, for the likes of yoga or working out or what have you, movie theaters, uh, the only ones on the river. So, you know, if it's late in the evening and uh, you just want to relax a little bit with your spouse or, or friends, uh, the movie theater is always an option as well. Now, this is the slide that, um, you know, it's always a, a challenge sometimes to, to sort of pull yourself out of, the in, of your competitive set and share with folks what makes you so different and distinct uh, from everyone else. And, you know, when it comes to Uniworld, we thought, look, we have so much to offer and we're so proud of what we offer. We really should call this out in a sincere way and just say, look, there are, there are certainly a lot of great options out there, a lot of great uh, and worthy competitors in our marketplace. And this is not necessarily to take away from them. I, I'm not intending to do that. This is more about just showing what we offer in contrast to all of those folks. And when it comes to Jewish heritage cruises, uh, which are year round and are incredibly uh, unique and beautiful, uh, whether it's over 80 exclusive shore experiences, whether it's the award-winning farm-to-table cuisine, 24-hour Wi-Fi, and suite butler service, 24-hour room service, self-service laundry, daily fitness classes, unlimited beverages, scheduled airport transfers, onboard entertainment, complimentary bicycles, multiple-day excursions, onshore or offshore gratuities are, are truly all-inclusive experience, only Uniworld brings this. Not anyone else, not Crystal, not Talk, not Scenic, not Ama, not Avalon, not Baiki, only Uniworld. There we go, moving right along. World travel is a family affair for us, and we have a, a something called the Generations Program, which is 25% off for young travelers, four to 17, two dedicated family hosts, kid-friendly menus. They get a special ship tour, which is always kind of exciting with the captain, seen behind the scenes, and special programs, events, and excursions designed specifically for those world travelers and training. What a phenomenal way for them to see Europe or any other part of the world, but multi-generational cruising, grandparents hosting grandkids, mom and dad hosting the kids, aunt and uncle, whatever it might be. Uh, you know, we certainly know the beauty of this program. We're family owned. Family is in our DNA. Family is what we're all about. And our generation programs certainly cater to that. And Travel and Leisure named us the top river cruise line for families. Uh, they've done that several times. So we're very proud of that distinction. And the Connoisseur Collection, you know, these are uh, really unique and incredibly gorgeous 
uh, designed uh, excursions that uh, are really about culinary focus. Uh, with you know, in the case of our French cruises, they'll take us uh, these excursions take you to famous restaurants, vineyards, orchids, truffle farms, other culinary hotspots. Uh, whether it's in Bordeaux or Rouen, wherever it might be, and you're experiencing again the the uh, beautiful French cuisine in this case, uh, and 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 oftentimes preparing, cooking, enjoying it right there on the spot. Uh, for example, La Chouan is where Julia Child first tasted French cuisine in the city of Rouen, which is served by the Joie de Vivre. Uh, it's served by the the B U by Uniworld experience. We're there. And I am, I, folks, forgive me, my uh, PowerPoint is slow today. Jewish uh, heritage. Guests are fascinated by this uh, aspect. This, is, again, is one of our more popular selling excursions. Jewish, uh, the Jewish culture and the history of Europe, it's inter, it's inter uh, uh, well, it really is inter, I guess the word I'm looking for is there's a, there's a interwoven narrative throughout European history of the contribution of people of the Jewish faith. Uh, and I think this is not something I, I don't want to mislead anyone. We encourage everyone to experience this. This is a human narrative. This is a human story. Uh, and whether it's the, the legacy that has been uh, built and, and is enduring in the Netherlands, Germany, or Switzerland, step back in time to some of the most, the, the oldest European Jewish settlements, uh, and then you know, flip that and embrace present uh, Jewish-inspired architecture, museums, and memorials. And we'll be adding all of these, uh, the, the Jewish theme itinerary to all of our 2019 authentic Danube and Prague itineraries. Again, I've done this; it's incredible. Uh, you know, it's a it's a step back into history that looks with an eye to the future, uh, and the the amazing contribution. And in oftentimes, as we all know, sacrifices that have been made by people of faith. It's, it's quite remarkable. Solo traveler. Well, not everybody likes to go with their spouse. <laughs> Some people like to uh, sometimes just do it themselves. And uh, they need a break. Uh, or they just want to enjoy. Or maybe they're, uh, uh, they're, they're, they're uh, not married or they're not in a relationship or or they just want a little time to themselves. Well, uh, we certainly have master planned itineraries that are uh, created and designed suited exclusively for the solo traveler. So we have open seating at every meal. No one's going to feel isolated or alone. Uh, we have small group excursions to begin with. So, uh, you know, with, and we try to design that around people with kindred spirits who share that passion for wherever they might be. So oftentimes, People may arrive uh, solo and not knowing anyone and not having any friends on board, but they always leave making new friends and, and truly enjoying uh, an incredibly well-planned, safe, convenient, and rewarding travel experience. Um, I, I can't say enough about this. We get ladies who are widows, gentlemen who are widowers, uh, and they come back and they say, you know, I met new friends. I felt safe. I, I never had to worry about anything, and it's an, it was just a really beautiful travel holiday, and that's what we want them to experience. Uniworld University. So I opened up this co this presentation today talking about uh, our commitment to the trade, our commitment to our partnerships, and, and Uniworld University is just an extension of that. Uh, it's a certified training program that can be completed essentially in one sitting, and uh, as a result of that, when you're graduating, you are certified as a, as a true Uniworld uh, selling specialist. Uh, listen, you points toward CLIA certification program. Uh, you have exclusive TA rates up to 70% off. You have access to the Travel Corporation, our parent company, uh, Agent Academy, uh, where you can learn about other uh, brands. And you have the 2018 River Cruise Specialist Signature Badge, which allows you to put Uniworld certified specialist at the bottom of your signature on your email so when you're reaching out to folks they know this is someone who knows what they're talking about and of course the listing on our online river cruise specialist directory so that's really uh, i encourage you you can find this online on our website uh, and just click through that and it will walk you through what you need to do we also believe that travel is everyone is for everyone so we do welcome all guests uh, we do believe in being a diverse uh, 
uh, company, and we extend that to creating travel experiences for a caring environment. Uh, so whether it's uh, uh, LGBT focused with or a gay or lesbian couple, or whether it's our uh, uh, straight folks, heterosexual uh, couples, you know, everybody's welcome. We don't really make a distinction. Uh, again, we're a family-oriented, family value company, and when you're on board, everyone is treated equally, treated with respect and dignity, and treated as part of our greater family, and that's what it's all about. Folks, at the end of the day, we just want everyone to have a really incredible experience and have a really great time and come home and talk about it. That's what's important. Uh, our guest loyalty program, uh, you know, it's outstanding. It truly is. I mean, we use that phrase in this presentation, and I think you'll see why. It's a welcome gift. It's member-only offers. It's a dedicated phone number for service uh, that can call in, complimentary in-room fruit platter, rather, priority notification, complimentary laundry service, exclusive Riverview Z magazine, and, of course, the famous cocktail parties on board with a captain uh, but most importantly is that there are river heritage savings it's a flat dollar amount that might depend on the itinerary and the ship that they're on but the savings can be upwards of seven hundred dollars so it's it's something that we are we acknowledge our, our repeat guests as Charlie mentioned so many of the guests on board that he experienced were, were Uniworld aficionados Uniworld uh, guests that had been on several voyages before, and this is just one small reason why, uh, and uh, we're very proud to offer this to all of our, uh, our past guests. Charter and incentive, not to be outdone, just a quick mention of that. We have a dedicated CNI department that offers incredible group benefits, so if you've got a large group that you want to do, uh, or you've got uh, perhaps that large group is so large that it's actually a full ship charter to that you uh, sort of take uh, over the ship, so to speak. Uh, we provide uh, custom customiz customized, uh, beg your pardon, customizable planning options. We designed it from the beginning to the end with you in mind and your guests. Uh, we have a European based operations team that is able to sort of be there on site when and where necessary. AV equipment, uh, onboard entertainment, and of course our, our very famous signature lectures that really accommodate and look after our CNI guests. Uh, so we do have a dedicated team there. You'll see charters at uniworld.com uh, is available, or your local DSM can certainly also uh, point you in that direction. So our 2019 preseason group program, this is coming up. And what you'll notice here is you can save up to $600 per person, and group discounts are combinable with our early booking savings, and that's about 10% uh, on all cruises, all cruises for River Heritage Club members. And River Heritage Club is folks who have been on Uniworld before. And they can earn a shipboard credit of up to $200, reserve seating, included a private group transfer, uh, three reduced single supplements, Cruise and category rates protected until the day of departure, which is huge. And tour TCs, tour conductors, one for every nine. So this is our 2019 preseason group program. Groups of 10 or more on guests traveling together on the same itinerary can get up to $600 savings per person, a shipboard credit of another $200 per person, and more on our European and Russian itineraries until June 30th this year for 2019, 2019. So please, if you have groups, or if you've got 10 people that you're quite certain that you could get, this is an amazing opportunity to take advantage of. It locks in the space, the space goes quick. The, the voyage, the ship rather, that Charlie was mentioning that he was on earlier in today's call, has a 98% load factor for 2018. The ship is full. Uh, and we expect that to be, be the case in 2019. So the sooner you book, the sooner you secure that space, the greater the probability that you'll have it. It's never too easy to, uh, it's never too early to plan rather. And as we have early booking savings offer in the market now and now through June 30th, you can book any 2019 itinerary and save 10% off your total cruise fare when, you pay, when the guest pays in full. So that's another 10% savings that is available for the guest that pays in full for their 2019 savings. 
And we're, we're very busy at the moment. Our operations team, our product team, our marketing team, everyone's working really hard to uh, craft and develop our new experiences that are coming up in 2019, including uh, the debut of a new super ship. As I mentioned, we're going to a super ship fleet, uh, the Royale, uh, which will make it her new debut in, in the spring of 2019. Uh, we've got a new ship in China on the Yangtze, uh, and sporting the largest cabins and suites on the river uh, with an astounding one-to-one -one guest ratio that we're really excited about. And that will include highlights of China, and uh, it'll go into Mongolia, which is, you know, how many folks have been to Mongolia? That's an incredible uh, and unique opportunity. So we're, we're building and we're developing, and things continue to move right along. But did you know, and this is something I mentioned a moment ago, that we really are, uh, Uniworld uh, is family owned and debt free. Uh, all of our ships are our ships uh, in the European market. Uh, we own them, we're able to invest in them, we're able to maintain the standards that we expect, and we do that debt free. And did you know that the River Queen is the only, and that's the ship you see here in this, in this picture, is the only river cruise ship with a true, real wood burning fireplace. So, uh, you know, what better place after a day of seeing Europe, having a nice meal, than coming there to uh, warm yourself by a wood fire over a nice, beautiful glass of Cabernet. I, I can't think of too many things nicer than that. And our parents taught us well. You know, we are proudly a member of the Travel Corporation, which is owned uh, by 100% uh, owned, privately owned by the Tolman family. And the Tolman family is a they have been in the hospitality business for four generations. And I mentioned them earlier, but whether it's Red Carnation, Insight, uh, Luxury Gold, Contiki or Trafalgar, there are so many companies and some of these names I'm sure you, you've probably heard of and, and work with. Uh, but we're very proud of that tradition and that legacy. And I can tell you from personal experience, this is a family that does not sit in a tower somewhere and uh, dictate and um, sort of let the, the businesses run themselves. This is a family that passionately believes in leading from the front, and they are there to ensure that the standards of quality, the amenities, the luxury that we offer is never compromised, is always kept uh, up to date and and um, uh, reflects the very best of what we feel that service should be. And uh, it's it's a wonderful uh, uh, commitment that I think speaks volumes of our of our ability to deliver uh, the world's best river cruise experience. And CLIA, you know, our great partners at CLIA. So we do have a 2018 CLIA uh, bonus line, uh, uh, cruise line bonus commission that's applicable. It's $50 bonus commission on any 2018 and 2019 sellings uh, through now uh, to December 31st of this year. The terms and conditions are there, but bonus commission is for only new bookings, for one new booking only. Uh, CLIA travel agency members cannot redeem multiple. Uh, you, we want you to limit the one coupon per travel agency member and bonus commissions are not retroactive if paid after the, uh, and is paid after departure date. But, you know, we get, uh, we probably get a dozen of these a week. So uh, please take full advantage. Uh, it's a wonderful opportunity and it just adds another layer of, of our commitment uh, to you. And so finally, folks, I know I've, I've probably have gone over my allotted time and I'm not sure there are gonna be any questions or not, but, uh, I'll start where I, I'll end this presentation where I started by again reaffirming our commitment to our trade partners. 95 to 96 percent of all of our revenue that we make as a company that is able to fund these experiences, that are able to maintain the ships that we sell and, and the standard of luxury and uh, refinement and beauty and elegance that we uh, we we truly believe in the level of service that we bring it's all because of the results of our partnership with our trade partners without you we wouldn't be here it's that simple um, and you know on behalf of everyone at Uniworld I can truly say that the support you've given us over the last 40 years or maybe you just started selling Uniworld this year or maybe you haven't even booked us yet but we want to thank you for your past support 
your current support, and hopefully your future support. It really does mean a great deal to us. Uh, we practice what we preach. We really do believe in this, and uh, we can't uh, really find the words to thank you enough. So thank you. And with that, we'll move into closing it out, and I'll invite uh, Anna or Charlie, whoever might be online, to um, let me know if there are any questions we can ask. Answer, rather. Sure. There are a bunch of questions coming in, um, and we'll have about 10 minutes to answer those, so I'll jump right in. Our first question is from David, and he's wondering what product development plans Uniworld has in the next five to 10 years. Well, a lot of it is uh, under review. I mean, that's a really great question, and, and really the most honest answer I can provide at the moment is we have some really incredible ideas of what we're looking at doing, uh, but we haven't determined uh, which ones that we're going to pursue at the moment. Uh, the, a five year is seems like a short amount of time, but in actuality, it's a, a pretty broad window. Uh, we do know that we're moving toward, as I mentioned, an all super ship fleet. Uh, and the next one, you know, we did the Beatrice for 2018 and 2019 will be the Royale and we'll move forward from there. But that doesn't necessarily uh, mean that we won't uh, look at new builds or different types of experiences. Uh, right now, everything is um, in the planning stages and we're keeping a very open mind. Gotcha. Thank you. Our next question is from Getty, who is a very new travel agent, um, and she's wondering how to get experience with Uniworld to share with her interested customers. Well, the first thing I could ask uh, Getty to do is to sign on to the website and, of course, complete the uh, Uniworld University program. That'll sort of give you a basic introduction to the experience and what it's all about. Uh, we do offer fam trips throughout the year, and I I'm not sure where she's based. But if she signs on and registers online and uh, at Uniworld.com as a travel partner, uh, she can find the sales team. And our, we have geographically based district sales managers throughout the Americas. And in the U.S., we have over 10 uh, nationwide. And to reach out to that DSM, and I am quite certain that they'll uh, get in touch with her to sort of walk her through the FAM opportunities and other ways that she could experience Uniworld for herself to sort of validate the experience. and should be able to share that with her clients. Yeah, perfect. Our next question is from Melinda, who is wondering if all categories have butlers. No, not all. It's 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 only for the suites. It's uh, if it's also included if clients have pre and post night hotel stays? That's a great question. Uh, air is included only when booking, uh, I'm sorry, transfers are included when only booking Uniworld Air. And I can attest to the fact, because I book Uniworld Air every, almost every other day. Uh, and we do have some of the, uh, the most competitive air rates in the industry. We work with a lot of different air partners, whether it be Delta, United, uh, American, or uh, British Airways, or KLM, you name it, uh, to, to, to and for Europe and around the world. Uh, so the air, the transfers are included when booking Uniworld Air. As far as the pre and post is concerned, uh, the the best way that I can answer that is not typically. However, there are exceptions that can be made from time to time, and uh, we'll work with the partner to determine what's possible. Uh, uh, and you know, usually the reason we we sort of are ambiguous about that is because it it really comes down to what might be in the best interest of the guest uh, when you're dealing with particular itineraries in Europe. Uh, and distances to and from the airport and what have you. Uh, but if they book Uniworld Air, the transfer to and from the ship to the airport is included. Uh, when it's involving pre and post uh, tours, uh, it is uh, something that we do work with on a case-by-case -case basis. Okay, that makes sense. Um, a lot of our agents are wondering if they can get the Uniquely Uniworld slides shared um, with them so they can share them with their customers. 
Yes, you can. I'll send that to you. And uh, do you want to make that available through your means or how, how would we like to do that? I could certainly share it. Perfect. Our next question is about food on the ships. How are special diets handled, um, especially gluten-free options? We have gluten-free dietary options. Uh, uh, and we're even working, believe it or not, we don't have it today, but we're even working toward having a, a kosher option if possible. But we do have gluten-free. Uh, we have vegetarian options as well. And all that is is simply when the travel partner calls in, they need to know which guest is uh, uh, preferring that particular uh, diet uh, option and will accommodate it uh, accordingly. That's not a problem. Perfect. Um, Angela is wondering what the average age of your guests is. Uh, yeah, it's a great question, and believe you me, uh, Angela, it's probably not what you think it is. Uh, it's always surprising when the analysis comes back month after month, season after season, year after year. We continue to see a decreasing age uh, in our average age guest on on what we uh, what we believe is. Um, really sort of an interesting uh, statistic. Uh, currently, the average age is about 65, and it can uh, it's 63 to 65. And 10 years ago, it was uh, about 10 years older than that. So we're seeing, uh, uh, you know, folks take advantage of these opportunities uh, a little sooner, a little younger. We also know that with our generation cruises, you've got families on board, children. So you can see, I, I'm, I'm always on, when I'm on board, uh, and I'm selling, I see folks that are typically, you know, my parents' age uh, in their mid-60s to their early 70s, but I also see there's always probably a good 25 to 30 percent of the crews that are, are even younger than me. So we do, you know, we're a great honeymoon option as well for, uh, uh, for folks, and matter of fact, uh, I was booking, uh, I had an agent that was booking one yesterday. So, uh, you know, it varies, but I would say on average in the early 60s. Okay. Our next question is from Angela, who is wondering if you'll be adding Oberammergau Passion Play to your 2020 cruises. Uh, I believe that is our intention, yes. I do not, you know, it's not confirmed yet because that's still in the planning stage, but we certainly would like to. Perfect. And I believe this next question, we'll have two more. Um, the next question is from Jackie, who's wondering, on you by Uniworld, how many optional experiences can be explored in a day with the included excursion? Well, you know, the included excursion, it depends on the day, it depends on the destination, because, because the, include, because the included uh, uh, excursion can have multiple uh, aspects to it. It can do more than just one thing or more than one uh, place. So. Uh, I'd have to say, you know, we'd have to take a closer look at the itinerary, but there's plenty to do that is included. Um, and of course, there's always additional side excursions uh, that are an option. Uh, and this is on you by Uniworld. So those are uh, something the guests would have to pay for. But again, they're exclusive uh, and really uh, no one else is doing what they're doing. That I can assure you, uh, because I've seen some of the things that you by Uniworld does and it, it caters to a very... Um, more youthful oriented uh, uh, target. And, you know, folks want to go behind the scenes of a DJ's concert in uh, Amsterdam at one in the morning. You by Uniworld can certainly make that happen. It's those type of experiences. They're one of a kind and they're really remarkable. And, uh, but there's plenty of options within the included excursion each day aboard You by Uniworld. Yeah, that sounds amazing. Our next and final question is from Z Gale, who is wondering, do you have accommodations for the physically challenged who might be wheelchair bound? Uh, it depends on the itinerary. And, and what, I remain, what I refer to on that, or what I, what I should mean by that rather, is that it really depends upon the ship's capacity. Uh, some of our ships are a little smaller. Some of our, our, our newer ships are all much bigger. So, and it depends on what type of wheelchair we're referring to. We just really have to vet out the guest and make sure that we can accommodate what their needs are. Uh, you know, sometimes uh, the guest may determine that, you know, the, the thing about river cruising, for example, is for those who have been on board is when you're in port, you line up horizontally behind each ship. And that can be a very cumbersome experience for someone who is 
uh, physically disabled or challenged or, or wheelchair bound. So we want to make sure that whatever the itinerary is and whatever ship they might be selling on, that it's a an easy, user-friendly sort of no hassle experience. Uh, and that just takes some betting out and that and that just takes the dialogue between our partner and our uh, support team here in uh, Los Angeles. Okay, great. And that is the end of our questions. That's perfect timing. Our hour is up. I'd like to thank you, Christian, for your time and for this webinar. And thank you to everyone that joined us. This was recorded and it'll be posted to CLIA's YouTube channel, which is CLIA Global. And we encourage you to go back, rewatch, and share. And that's it. Thank you guys so much and have a fantastic weekend. Thank you, Anna. Thanks, everybody. Thank you and have a great day. Okay, bye.